Chris Consane here. I'm Jen. And I'm Matt. And today we got GT Goku from Power Absorbed. Yep. Um, so the leader auto, when his card is placed in your leader area, send up to one Android 20 Ventral Alliance and one Dr. Mew Ventral Alliance from your deck to your warp. Okay. Oh. Uh, and then auto, when this card attacks, you look at top five cards of your deck, add up to one green sand card from one into your hand and shuffle your deck. Uh, awaken when you life at 4 or less, or you have two or more energy, rather, or two or more Sun Goku GT cards in your warp, draw one card, switch out to one of your energy to active modes, and add cards until you got six left. Well, that's a nice payoff. Uh, and then the awaken, it's got three autos. Okay, uh, first one, Auto Wasp Return. When a Pan card or a card with GT in its character name, both green and without Son Goku GT, is placed in your battle area, in, from, from, battle from your battle area, into your drop, add it to your Z energy from the drop. Okay. Auto, when this card attacks, you draw a card, and then Auto, at the end of your turn, choose up to one of your green Android 18 Z battle cards and switch it to active mode. Ta-da! <laughs> So we've got Son Goku and Android 18 Vital Teamwork. I'm going to be going back. Oh, joys. Um, it's got the Fight Dual Attack. It's got um, 20k and it's an SR. It's got Auto. If you leave the Green Son Goku GT card, when this card is played, you can one of your opponent's battle cards and then costs less than or equal to the number of mono green Saiyan cards in your drop and KO it. Um, auto then 1. When this card attacks, your opponent chooses one of their unisons with a specified cost of 3 or less and place it in your drop. If you don't place a card in their drop, they discard one card from the hand. Ooh. And active main with one, pay to green. If you have three or more ZNG and a green Z battle card to play, play this card from your hand. That is going to be good in green Saiyans. Yeah. Just, well, I suppose it's just going to be good in green in all fairness, just because you can still do the second auto and the limit one. Uh. And it's kind of tired if your opponent is one of their unisons. Yeah. Uh, I, I can see it being used in green quite a bit. Like, yeah, just a new green card, generically. Yeah. <laughs> um, Alright, so we've got Super Saiyan 4, Sun Goku to Hell and Back. Uh, 3 costs, 15 permanent. While you have an Android 18 card in play, this card gains critical. And you got activate main, limit one, pain a green. If you have three more energy and there are three or more pan cards and all cards with GT in their character names, all green and without some Goku GT in your Z energy, battle area and or uh, and or drop, play this card from your warp. Hmm. Okay. And then actually battle limit one, if you leave the card as a green Son Goku GT and one of your green Android 18 Z battle cards is in the battle, use this card from your warp in a combo. Pretty useful. Did you? Free combo. Yeah, it's free combo or just a um, place. So, got Super Saiyan Vegeta's Spirit of Resistance, 3 cost 20k. At permanent, if the leader is green, Sun Goku GT card, for each Goku GT in your warp, reducing his cost of card count by 1. So, being as the leader requires there to be 2 to do the early awaken, Vegeta comes out as a 1 cost. Um, Auto limit 1, when this card attacks, draw 1 card, discard 1 card. And choose to one of your opponent's back cards, edge cost 4 or less, and KO it. And then auto, pay 1 green, if the leader is green, go for GT. When this card is used in combo, choose one of your green Saiyan cards and gain double strike for the battle. So, another inbuilt jumper. Yeah. Alright, so you got Sun Gohan's Spirit of Resistance. It says 2 cost, 10k, counterplay, pay in a green. Uh, play this card, and then if the battle card being played has an inch cost of 4, as it's placed in the same as drop instead. Uh, permanent, if your leader card is a green Son Goku GT card, and a green Son Goku GT card is in your warp, reduce your energy cost this card in your hand by 1. Okay, so basically playing the deck, you'll be fine. <laughs> yeah. um, auto limit 1, when this card is played, draw 1 card and choose it to one of your opponent's units and remove a marker from it. Um, yeah. That's a uh, for for uh, for one energy. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm not sure how it works tonight because you pay. Oh, it's only two energy. Well, it'd be three energy or two if you're playing Goku GT. Oh uh, yeah, because it's got like 
Yeah, because you've got to pay one for its counterplay. But you've also got to pay for its... Actual play. Yeah. But it is pretty good as a counterplay for green. I'll give it that. It's not a bad counterplay. Or is that not meant to be there? That's meant to be there. That is meant to be there. That is okay. meant to be there. Okay. It's just... It's a bit weird. <laughs> but it's not bad. So... Because it doesn't say... Like... Hang on. Auto pay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I don't know. So it basically makes it so its cost is two. So how many you work it is in this deck, its cost is two. Yeah. Because of that and it getting reduced. So. Yeah. That doesn't. I don't know why they've done that. There's literally no point to that. You literally could just have just had it as a free cost and make it good as two cost and cut out this bit. Literally could have, but I suppose it stops it from being too splashable because of being able to draw and remove the marker and stop a card coming into play. Yeah. So, but freeze it. <laughs> but that, 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 that's really good. Yeah. It does so much. Um, so we've got Super Saiyan Force Son Goku Stygian Journey. Um, it's got Unique, 15k. It's a permanent. While you have an Android 18 card in the play, this gains 5k power. Or auto, when this card is played, choose one of your opponent's battle cards and KO it. And then active main, number one, pay green if you have three or more energy and have three or more pan cards and or cards with GT in the character names, all green and not Goku, in your ZNG battle layer and or drop, play this from your wall. So you can only ever have one of these out. Yeah. These, these GT Goku, by the looks of it, even if the other ones don't have, because this one doesn't have unique, yeah. but its effect then means you can't play it out anyway. Pretty much, they're, they're very weird, but I suppose the idea is that you're able to bring up some big things from the warp by paying one. Yeah. So. Alright, uh, so we got Sun Goten, Spirit Resistance, or Spirit of Resistance, uh, 2 cost 10k, permanent, if your leader card is a green Sun Goku GT card, uh, and a green Sun Goku GT card in, is in your warp, reduce the energy cost on your hand by one. Okay, so playing the deck. Yeah. Uh, auto limit one when this card is played, draw a card, choose one of your opponent's battle cards, energy cost of one and KO it. And then auto limit one if your leader card is a green sun Goku GT card. When you add this card to your Z energy, draw a card and discard a card from your hand. It's a lot of draw on this card. Yeah. <laughs> so like just, just just draw. Just, just fine, just keep going, it's fine. <laughs> so we've got Sun Goku Golden Dragon Fist. Um, so it's a Z leader, costs 2 ZNG, and it's got 25. Oh no, Z battle card. That's my bad. Cost 4. I didn't. From my brain, saw the 4. I was like, Z leader. And it's like, no. The battle card. Um, yeah. Yeah, I know. I, I'm aware of my mistakes. So he's got. Per, well, there are 3 or more um, pan cards or GT cards that aren't Goku in your ZNG battle or and drop here. This gains double strike and dual attack. I'm just gonna cut so much of that text. So it's basically just like have other GTs but Goku for Christ's sake. <laughs> um, when this card is played, choose one of your opponent's battle cards and care of it. And an active main that one pay to green if leader is green Goku GT Z leader and you have four more energy and choose one of your green to Goku GT cards, then it's cost three or more. Play this card from under an Android 18 on top of the chosen card in active mode. So you just place it on top of a Goku from underneath your 18. Yeah. That's pretty good. Vanilla Oob. Woo! 2 cost 20k. Oob. Pan. Super combo. G generic green. That you four or less life. Draw a card, it's got the 10k straight up around it being zero and you have your four or less life to gain a 10k as well. Yeah. The only thing about this is the fact that it's pan. Literally, it's it's a green pan. It's the only relevance to it. I mean, you could, as super comes for a deck, you could run this, and there's a sparking five Vegeta, which is a GT and is green. So you could just run those and have them as your different name things for your um, abilities. Yeah. So, so you start with a green sparking one. Um, so we've got Sun Goku, Full Strength, Kamehameha. This is a Z leader. 
Yay. I'm glad that it is. <laughs> Matt's giving me this look of like, well done. <laughs> You know, like when you're kind of proud of someone, but you don't want to admit, so you just give them like this small smirk. This is what I'm getting right now. Um, it costs one ZNG, uh, Z awakens by paying one green onto a green Joker GT when you run four or less. Um, auto, discard one green from your hand when this card attacks, draw two. Uh, secondary auto, once per turn, if it's your turn, when your opponent uses a card in the combo, place it to one card from your opponent's combo area in their drop, which is pretty good, it's denying ZNG. Um, active main. Once per turn, switch one of your Android 18Z battle cards to rest mode. Choose all of your opponent's battle cards with blocker, ignoring barrier, KO them, and this gains 5k power for the turn. That's alright. Gets rid of blockers, so I guess it stops all the negates, but. Eh. Ah, oh, well, getting rid of going. Getting rid of blockers is always good. Yeah. Just like people don't really play blockers outside the block and the gates nowadays. Unless they need to. Unless a deck. Unless cards already have blockers. Like, so the um, six cost Goku Blitz World well, thing that's a blocker. Yeah. So. And it's just a good card overall. So yeah, some cards will just have. Some decent cards just have blocker anyway. Yeah. Um. Yeah, okay, I did go on to note. Alright, okay. So we got Android 18 uh, Rifle Strike. So it's one cost, two Z energy, it's a Z battle card, it's got unique barrier, it's got a Z stack, um, one of a green Sun Goku GT. <coughs> Wherever he is. There yep. he is! That one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and it's got permanent during your turn, while you have two or more green Sun Goku GT cards in your warp, this card gains 6k. So it becomes 10k. So it's 4k power. Hmm. That's alright. But you're meant to play it out quite quickly, aren't you? So. Yeah. Um, we got Goku's Kamehameha Deflection. So it's one cost to extra card. It's got counter attack, negate the attack. Oh, limit one, negate the attack. And choose one of your opponent's back cards and it's cost four less and KO it. Um, Shouldn't this be if, you, if your opponent's uh, back card is an Android card? <laughs> you know, because then at least it, <laughs> oh. it matches the other card then. I <laughs> I always find that sort of stuff and stupid. Like it'd be dumb with, if it was like Androids because there's enough Android stuff out there, but it is more specific than saying. <laughs> um, but if the leader is a green Goku GT Z leader, you can activate this card skill from your hand without paying attention cost by discarding another card from your hand instead. Um, and then yeah, you just stop the attack and blow up at four cost. Honestly, this is just a really good green negate. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's probably why it's limit one. Is like, you would just be there, like, pay one, blow up, pay one, blow up, pay one, blow up. It's the slowest mirror force in the world. <laughs> <laughs> um, Alright, so we got Android 18 for the sake of family. So one cost, 4k. Uh, also, when it's played, look at top five. You had a green Saiyan uh, with an energy cost of four or less from the energy hand of your deck. Alright, so just your normal searcher for a deck. Hmm. Um, auto limit one, if your leader is a green Sun Goku GT Z leader, when this card is used in a combo against an extra thousand combo for the battle. Yeah. Awkward numbers! Yeah! Yeah, we love awkward numbers! <laughs> 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 uh, so we've got Trunk Spirit of Resistance. It's 2 cost 10k. If the leader is a green Goku GT and the green Goku GT is in your warp, reduces cost by one. Uh, permanent, whilst you have four more energy, he gains blocker. Then auto limit one. When he's played, you draw a card. Nice. Power of blockers. <laughs> oh, and then. Spoiler alert! <laughs> you saw nothing! Um, that'll be a later video when the last secret rare gets revealed. <laughs> when the last secret rare gets revealed, guys, we will cover all of them in one video. Um, anyway, so yes, that is the Goku GT deck from the Power Absorbed. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Leave any thoughts in the comments below. Hit that sub button, and we will see you next time. So, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.